Hey guys, in this video I am gonna show you how to install Pixelized ROM in Redmi Note 3 and after that I will discuss the top 5 features of Pixel ROM. To install the Pixel ROM you have an unlock bootloader and TWRP recovery installed. If you haven't done it yet then I have given the video links in the description. Now boot your device into TWRP recovery. Take a backup of your device if anything went wrong so we can revert it to original. Take your backup in micro SD card or your external USB device because the internal storage will be wiped later. Now select backup and click all the options present there. Don't forget to select micro SD card. Now select swipe to backup. It will take around 10 to 15 minutes to backup your device. After taking backup of your device go to the main menu of TWRP. Now select wipe. Click on advanced wipe. Select Delvic system data and cache. Do not select internal storage or micro SD card. Now select swipe to wipe. After wiping out the data, go to main menu and select install. Here select the pixel rom zip from your internal storage. Now select swipe to confirm flash. It will take 5 to 6 minutes. Select reboot system. It would take some time to boot up, so please don't panic. After booting up, the pixel setup will be started. I will skip the setup. Let's check the fingerprint sensor, it is working or not. It is working perfectly fine. Now your pixel room has been set up. Now we will go and check about the device info. The device is Redmi Note 3 and the Android version is Nougat 7.1.1 and it is based on the lineage OS. Let's check about the voltage. Is it working or not? In call setting we can see that the voltage option is enabled. Let's try to call. Welcome to Geo Tele Verification. Please keep your thumb. You can see that it is working perfectly fine. Now let's go and check about the camera. It is working so don't worry about it. The first feature is the live wallpaper. The live wallpaper is exclusively available to pixel device only. Here are the live wallpaper from where you can set it. It looks awesome but it also consumes your battery. The second feature is the app shortcut option in app icon. You can directly open some commands in the apps without opening the app. For example composing a new message in the messaging app by the shortcut. It is very time saving and useful tool. The third feature is the on screen button. You can enable the on screen button from settings. This will disable your hardware buttons. Later that you can turn it off. The fourth feature is the Google Pixel animation on home button. Whenever you press the home button you can see a small animation on the home screen button which is kind of a pixel logo. And the fifth feature is the multi window. You can open two apps at a time and can do simultaneously work. But it doesn't support all apps, some apps can't be splitted. If you don't like the pixel ROM or if you wanted to revert back to original MIUI ROM, then you can see my next video for how to revert back to MIUI from any custom ROM. The video link is in the description. If you had any query regarding to this video, you can post in the comment section. Thanks for watching the video guys.